I'm sorry. So today we are going to be doing a another thrift haul, try on haul type video. I am really feeling these lately and um, since I moved to Oregon I have had a lot of mixed um, experiences with thrifting. I know in Portland it's like impossible to get a good deal unless you go to the Goodwill outlet. Um, but in all the other like surrounding cities or suburbs um, I've had a lot of good luck shopping and I've got a lot of things. A lot are from the Goodwill outlet, so everything is like a dollar per pound. Or it is from Salvation Army, and they have a lot of half-off sales. So if something is like five dollars, that ends up being two fifty, which is like crazy good price for some high-waisted pants or shorts. So yeah, we have a lot of vintage stuff uh, that we're going to be looking at today, and as well as a few other miscellaneous things so yeah if you're interested keep on watching so I just want to start off by saying that I got a lot of items I mean a lot like massive trash bags full of items for like less than $30 for a massive bag so I split this up into multiple hauls um, basically three different hauls but that's just you know uh, between Caleb and I's stuff my boyfriend and I's stuff so we got a lot like a lot so if you're interested there's going to be more of these. If you're new, feel free to subscribe. Uh, I post thrift hauls a lot, so if you're interested in more stuff like this. Alright, so, I'm also interested in doing a thrift, a thrifted lookbook type video, so if you want to see, like, how I style these items, let me know and I will definitely film that. It's getting nicer out, spring is finally coming through. Um, it is still kind of rainy here, I mean, it's Oregon, so what do you expect, but... There's a lot of really beautiful days where I can film outside now, so yeah. First thing I'm going to show you guys is this huge blanket. It looks like this. And, oh my god, this would make a great backdrop. I feel like I want to use this as a backdrop now. It's huge, and I have like two other blankets like this, but they're not as big. But they end up being like, you know, only two or three dollars. So, yes. And then the next home item is this <laughs> porcupine hedgehog playing keyboard and this is from Ikea because it says right here but also from the Goodwill outlet I'm so excited like whenever I have an actual bed to like put things on the bed oh hyped then starting with the actual clothing items we have this American Apparel denim skirt it's like light wash in a size and medium which I am so lit it just looks like this. It's like high waisted, like vintage worn looking look, but then it's like this really thick sturdy material. So yeah, I love that. This next item is the reason why I tell people that if you're going to go to the thrift store, you need to spend an hour or two there because you don't just go through the sections that are your size. Um, like I wouldn't just go through like the medium section of pants. I'm typically a size four, five. But because like it's a thrift store, there's different sizes with vintage items, and employees just kind of throw things wherever they think they go. So this was in the extra small area. I'm a 28 waist, which is not extra small. That is like borderline, I guess, like medium large. My God, this is so high waist. Like it comes in so much at the waist, which I'm living for. But look at this, Tommy Hilfiger, Tommy girl. High waisted shorts, and these were $5.99 and then half off of that, so $3 for these shorts. So, always look in every area, every section. I'm like slowly rolling away on my chair. I don't know, I still had the sticker on it, but it didn't have the tags. It's a size large, it's a little big, but I figured it would shrink in the wash if I needed to. Um, it fits a little loose on me. It's this Ralph Lauren tank top, which I think was like a dollar. So this is like a, it's this Adidas magenta top. It's a size medium, and then we got this Nike hat. This was a dollar, and I haven't washed it yet, so like sorry, but there it is. <laughs> it's kind of small, like I can fit it, but like barely. But dainty little dress. And it has, it's like 
a light blue periwinkle color with like darker blue and red flowers on it. So this would be perfect for 4th of July if I can hold on to it till then. And then I also got this cardigan. It's just a basic white cardigan that you can find at like Gap or Old Navy or whatever. Um, just to kind of throw over dresses like the one I just showed you. So that's, you know, just a basic but an essential. And then um, it's this Adidas size medium. They're a little loose on me for being a medium, but they're these leggings. It says Adidas here. I love the color, I love the pattern, and I love the material it's made out of. I just like that they're a little loose on me, but they will be good to work out in, I guess, or just lounge in. We have two more items. So this is another like lounge pair of pants. These are also Adidas. They're just these sweats. They're a size small. I thought they were medium when I bought them, but you know, it is what it is. I wish they would have been medium because they are kind of small, like they fit, but I feel like if I were to kick my legs up, like it'd be a little too short. But my legs are up really long, so yeah. Standard. I think these were only like $2 or something, so just some good at home pants or just taking the dogs to the dog park kind of pants. The last item is. Oh my god, I am. I love these pants. Okay, so these are high waisted Wrangler dark wash jeans. They're really nice. They're just straight leg vintage mom jeans. And this is what the butt looks like. There's no pockets on the back, which I kind of like also. So yeah, this was a great find. I believe this one was, what was it? $3, half of $5.99. So yeah, amazing finds from the thrift store lately. Oh my god, that was a lot to get through and I still have to do the try-ons. But there's going to be a lot more hauls coming up because we've just found so many good things. A heads up, the haul that I'm going to be doing next is going to have a lot of Nike apparel and high-waisted stuff as well. And the haul after that one is going to be a lot of sports, like vintage windbreakers there we go vintage like windbreakers and jackets oh my god some great dad hats and just like a lot of pullover jackets i don't know you'll see it's gonna be caleb's items and mine i mine items my items so yeah if you're interested in those make sure you're subscribed and you stay tuned they will be up within the next week or two so yeah i love you guys so much and i hope you enjoyed today's try on haul let me know what your favorite items from today's video were down below if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Alright, I love you guys. Bye!